This video will show you how to create epic accounts for your students that are anonymous. So what you'll do is you'll go to the getepic.com website for educators. You can either type the web address up here or select the educator tab. And then once you're here, if you don't have an account already, you'll select join Epic School and you'll fill out the information here to create an account. If you already have an account for your class, then you'll select login, select student and educators, and then you'll get to this page where it says educator login and login with Google or your educator email address. I'm going to select Google. So click your school email address to get into your class. Once you're in your dashboard for Epic, on the top right hand corner you'll see My Students and you're going to want to select Roster. Once you're in Roster, you'll see your class on the top right. You'll see your class code is going to be right there. And then now we're going to create our student accounts. You'll select Add Students. And in this section is where you're going to add your student accounts. To keep it anonymous, you're just going to maybe number them. So one, two, three. So it's going to be, the number is going to be associated with a student. So you'll have to remember which number goes with which student. Maybe you want to go alphabetically down your roster. You can decide how you want to do that. I'm just going to add seven students for this example. And we're going to select continue. And you'll, you'll notice this option, import Google Classroom. You will not want to do that because we are creating anonymous accounts and that's why we are just labeling the students with numbers or letters or however you would like to keep it anonymous. Then you'll select continue and where it says confirm students, you'll see the first name has the number and then the second column is optional. And you don't have to enter anything in that one because, again, we're going to keep this anonymous. Okay, and then you're going to select Confirm. Once you have confirmed that, you'll see that you have your students listed in your class. You're going to go ahead and select Login Instructions. In Login Instructions, you'll notice that there's laptops and there's iOS. So if your students have Chromebooks or laptops, you're going to select this option. They will get this link or they can just type it in manually. It's kids.epic.com slash students. And then they're going to enter their class code. If they have an iPad, they're going to first download the Epic app. They'll select or tap students and then they're going to enter their class code. For students, when they're accessing Epic via a Chromebook or a laptop, they would go to kids.epic.com slash students and then they'll enter your class code just like that. Select go and then it's going to take them to your class screen with all the students. They'll know which one is theirs. You're going to tell them prior and then they can select their number or whichever anonymous ID they have. They might see this screen that says welcome back. They're going to select the school option and once they select that they will get into their Epic account and you'll notice that students have the option of changing their avatar if they would like to. They click on their avatar, select view profile and then they can click on the little pencil and you'll notice that they have a certain amount of options that they can choose from and the more books they read, the more options of avatars they get. So, you know, if you read uh, one book, you get a few options. If you read 10, 20, you get more and more options. So that's how they can start changing their avatar. So that's it. This is how you create anonymous Epic accounts for your students.